Today, I'm going to try and recreate one of my favorite salsas of all time. And the specific salsa is this one. It's the Orange Volcano Salsa. It's from one of my favorite taquerias in the San Francisco Bay Area, but specifically in San Mateo because the one in San Francisco is not as good, but it's Taqueria Pancho Villa. And I could literally bathe in that Orange Volcano Salsa. Okay, now after five failed attempts, I think there's chili de arbol, garlic, chicken bouillon, and some canola oil. So I started off by de-seeding some of my chili de arbol, and then I started kind of getting my garlic ready. I preheated some oil, again, neutral oil, and then I got my onion ready I only took a quarter of that onion and then one Roma tomato and then I went with frying my chili de arbol because they have that like nutty flavor you know what I'm talking about it's similar to like just straight chili oil um, and then I added some garlic I took those chilies out and then I soaked them in some hot water so they could get soft and then I roasted up some tomatoes and then also a quarter of an onion and seasoned that with chicken bouillon placed it in an oven until they were nice and soft and then I blended it now here's the thing when you add oil to any sort of red thing in a blender it's gonna turn orange so that's where I think the color comes from as you could see in the picture I showed you at the very beginning but I got the color I seasoned it with a little bit more salt and then I finally tasted it now here's the thing I thought it needed a little bit of refrigeration but I'm just gonna say I think I made the Walmart version it was not the same and if anyone has any insight please let me know